news, we have another bike and we're taking this one very seriously. If you like pina coladas and getting caught in the rain. Steve's bought himself a KTM 390 Adventure. But what was wrong with the BMW 310? The BMW 310, it isn't a bad bike. Just for me, that sculpted seat was f***ing shit. <laughs> God. The BMW 310 isn't a bad bike. For me, that sculpted seat was a problem. It was too restricting and it became a huge irritation. The budget 390 is a lot of fun. It's really well furnished at about four grand on the used market. This bad boy came with engine guards, a jungle munching bash plate, Motec foot pegs, rear rack, a hugger, adjustable levers, and the most essential adventure accessory of all, an acro. Strangely, it also came with Specsavers finest LCD protector. Really? Apart from that, Steve's on cloud 10 with his KDM. Oh dear. <laughs> the 390 weighs about the same as the 310, but puts out a much more respectable 43 horsepower. And thankfully, Steve is getting along with the KDM seat. You won't find much better suspension as stock. These 43mm WPs are courtesy of the 790 and 890 Adventure, and the bike is brimming with high-tech goodies, if you can focus on them. But it's all looking pretty rosy for Steve and the KDM. I'm sure nothing can go wrong. Not long after that, Steve decided to pick a fight with a tree branch and a muddy root. He didn't win. How's your rib? F off! <laughs> Is it not going well, mate? No. <laughs> That's okay, it's just a cracked rib, it'll heal. Oops. But I'm sure Steve will be back to full strength. Perhaps not. Moving on, if we compare the KTM 390 Adventure to my Honda CRF 250 Rally, the KTM is looking more of a street bike, especially with those cast wheels. Steel spokes are much stronger, but to be fair, alloy wheels mean tubeless tyres. Steve could plug a puncture in 30 seconds. And as for bendy alloy, well it's never been a problem in the past, even on far heavier bikes in rocky Spain. Okay, the Adventure is a 390 Duke. But with longer suspension, a 19 inch front, a few tweaks and decent shoes, this bike has great potential. As always, the proof is in the proverbial. Steve and I are off on another trail riding adventure soon. Ish. Subscribe to see if the KDM goes kaput or outshines Honda's soft roader. Thanks for watching. Ah, my ribs! <laughs> Stop making this laugh. <laughs> <laughs> You know, Dawn's never gonna let us ride again after this. <laughs> I've tweaked my knee, I've cracked a rib, at least one. <sighs> oh, to you, oh, Don't. the worst that could happen. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my rib. Oh.
I'm going to just do that again. I'm sorry. Ah.